And hey there guys, what's going on? And welcome back to the Ultimate RTG. And today, we're gonna be doing a mid or prime icon player pick. And I know what you're thinking, I don't believe that's a good idea. Well, you're probably right, but I wanna test my luck when it comes to a player pick, because I've never done one of these for an icon before in the RTG. And maybe that's where my luck lies. Or I could get a bunch of clearance sale ones that I don't want. That's also a possibility. But I just believe when you've got a selection of three, surely one of those is going to be good, or at least take your fancy. I don't mind a mid icon that's OP. Obviously, a prime icon would be great. And I've seen some really good ones. Ronaldinho, R9, like EA are prepared to give them out. It's not like they've released this and played around with the pack weight. I have seen a couple of Ronaldinho's. So if you wouldn't mind giving me that, that'd be awesome. But now we're going to test it out. I did clear out pretty much most of the stuff that I had at the club. But I also did a few of these player picks. And I can't recommend them enough. Yuri Bacice What If card. And that didn't cost a lot to craft. You want to buy a bunch of non-rares or just get yourself some rares as well. You probably do have a lot of this stuff already at the club to be able to craft these. And it's better than going on the market and spending like 40k for an 87. And speaking of an 87, we got Chesney. Uh, we got uh, well, Yuri Pachice, but I haven't submitted him. I'm hoping that he'd get an upgrade. That's, that's a good option to play maybe as a center back with uh, Cunha or something. I don't know. But then we got this matey as well, Pereira, that makes one of the best right mids in a 3 5 2. Because he's right footed, he can hit it across goal, and he just looks really good in general. So we're going to be using him um, as well as uh, Boateng, I'm going to bring back just to test him out to see if he's like any decent. Uh, another patch has been dropped on PC. I don't know if there's any gameplay changes, but it is pretty mad. But what have I been doing on the account? Grinding. Yesterday, I spent, what, like five hours just getting everything done. I was uh, doing the trades with Bonucci. All of those have sold. Awesome. Because of this uh, middle icon uh, player pick, they went up a bit more. So some of them sold for like 21,000, 20,000. So that's amazing. And I've done all the icon objectives, the icon swaps. Uh, in squad battles, that took a while, but we, we've done it. And I've got some bonus packs that you're, you're seeing that now. The Silver Beast objective, season progress, like you name it. We have done everything all in a day. What we haven't done though is Caputo. And I was checking the the game mode. What, you got to use, what, bronzes? You got to use bronzes in, in March, yeah? Okay, well, that's interesting because I don't think I've ever had to use a bronze card on the game. So that might be pretty funny to do. Uh, anyway, Cucurella still needs to be unlocked. So I need to get my move on there. But at least everything's really just done out of the way. And we can move on. But if you are enjoying the series, hitting a thumbs up would be absolutely amazing. And if you're new to the channel, maybe think about subscribing uh, to not miss my videos or content. So let's take a look to see what was submitted. And if I remember rightly, because this is going to be on your screen, not mine... We had Van Bergen and Grealish in the first squad. And Van Bergen, I don't actively use. I've got Robin and Grealish, I don't really want. So maybe some of you will question like, oh, you could have used those in objectives and stuff. Yeah, I could, but I don't desperately need them. So I didn't mind submitting that. In the second team, we had a couple of informs that I already had at the club. Uh, so yeah, that was easy to complete pretty much. The fourth team as well, was it not up of a bunch of like 83s i had allison already at the club so that was really really helpful what you will see though is a duplicate harry kane i'm pretty sure he was submitted in the second team and then he's also in the fourth now one already had untradeable the other i bought for uh 69 000. like a couple of like, i had to go and purchase like coke and then parejo harry kane and i think maybe one other player so in total i think uh, for this spc i spend Maybe just shy of a uh, hundred thousand coins or slightly over, added with what I had at the club. And I think that's a GG, really. A hundred thousand coins, stuff that I don't really want to use. And we've got a possibility of pulling a middle prime icon. Now, if it was down to me, I would rather a guarantee. I always say this I don't really like this Kinder Surprise lottery, you know, when you're not going to get anything for your grind. But maybe today we will get lucky. All right. So. Give me those good vibes in the comment section. Middle Prime Icon is the first time ever we've had a player pick for an icon on the Road to Glory. So, fingers crossed, man. Come on. Can I just get one insane icon? Um, that would be absolutely amazing. Uh, this is the stuff that I was buying for the player picks, and I run out of non-res. 
So I don't need them. Actually, just send them over to the trade pile. Otherwise, they don't look good. I need to show you my trades as well. But one of three, prime or mid? Should it should it not be like mid or prime? But we're starting with prime first. Okay. Any predictions? Do you think I'm going to get screwed over in every single one? Surely not. Three, two, <laughs> one. Jeez. Oh. That is pain. It's painful. It's painful. Like, all right, let's look, let's look at these players. Guardiola, CDM. Um, I've got better CDM already, and his strength and aggression really puts me off. Ashley Cole, um, by no means is he a bad icon. Like, it's, it's pretty solid. Like, I think he's going to be a good card on the game, but his prime icon moments just looks that much better, and he's also, like, pretty affordable if you were to just trade up. So taking an Ashley Cole and then not being able to make that upgrade in the future or feeling like it's a bit of a waste doesn't interest me. And then Schweinsteiger um, doesn't really look all that bad, but just a bit heavy. Uh, but then again, I have tried his prime version and he's all right, you know. High tie work rate, six foot. Uh, good stamina in that. Good tackling. <laughs> Oh my, I just, I'm done. So before I rearrange the starting 11, we still have these packs to go and open. I apologize. The icon just threw me off a little bit. I didn't, whoa. All right, well, that's good. Okay, I'll take it. Harry Kane? Oh. Oh, that's all right though, 87. I bet he's like 50K, a trend. But let me just quickly show you the trade pile right now. Uh, these Bonucci's. Uh, the first few sold the other day, and then uh, yesterday I was selling them for 20,000 coins. The Romagnoli sold as well. So, yeah, I was, I was just, like, overall happy with the moves that we made. And the money that we spent, like, the extra money we spent on the Icon, we made from Bonucci, like, sales. So, we're all good. But let's try and uh, figure out how we're going to rework this team a little bit. So, someone like Kante won't get used, like, I guess. If we're going to be bringing in... Uh, Schweinsteiger, at least he's 91 rated. Like, it's not, not the end of the world, right? How do I get Schweinsteiger into this team, though? Um, like that. All right, well, we have no chemistry down this right-hand side. Now, what I can do for today's video is use Robin and then bring Kleiber in just to help. And if we do like the feel of Schweinsteiger, then maybe we'll get him into our foot champs team. But I, I, don't, I don't know. There's no guarantee. But at least we've got a couple of players to try out. What, what chem style should we apply? Um, if he's going to be anchoring the midfield, I would say Shadow. Rivals it is. Damn. All right. Hold on. Is that team on full chem? No, it's not. But he does look really solid. Schweinsteiger. <laughs> what plays? He's got a couple of interceptions in already. No, but I swear I used. I swear. Go on, El Shirari. Good goal. What plays? But anyway... Uh, no, one thing I do like is that Schweinsteiger and Matthias are both 91 rated, and they're also from Germany. So it just looks cool for my team. It does, I don't know if it's going to play that well, but it just looks good. And that's what makes uh, the difference, right? Go on. Schweinsteiger, unlucky. This guy's not bad. Boateng. Well played. Oh, this, this Boateng is feeling a little bit better. It's like Reece James situation all over again. So I've got to give these guys more more game time to really test it out. Go on, Robin. Go on, Iron. Go on, Iron. Schweinsteiger. Good ball. Thank you. Simple, but effective. Hang on a minute. Yo, that's too easy. That is way too easy. But I have got rid of Kante. You know, I don't know how important Kante is. Oh, God. Oh, dear. Well, he made the effort to tackle, but I think he's tackled himself. Schweinsteiger's going to have to play insanely well. But that's the fun of it. 4-0, 45 minutes in. Oh, no, it's the Germans, you know? That's that's what's happened. It's because I've got so many German players in the team. I just, I feel like it's adding that stability. You can never go wrong with a German. And we're winning 4-0. This is fantastic. Four shots, four goals. And that's how I feel. I feel pretty calm today. Nice and calm. I'll show you how I've set out the team, though. Uh, Schweinsteiger, Mateus, boom. Uh, we've got Acuna in his, his preferred role on the left-hand side. And then Pereira, he's, he's, he hasn't really done much, though. I think maybe he'd play better as, like, a center mid in a 4-3-1-2, 4-1-2-1-2. Do you know what would have been sick, actually? 
is if the selection gave me the prime version of Mateus. I don't think I really need it, though. With the way this one plays, he is more than good enough. Like, honestly, you don't need a prime Mateus. But it would have just looked a lot better. You no, know, the prime moments looks even better. That's the one I want. I just want prime icon moments. I love that. I love visually. They just look so nice. Ah, he's done well there. Watch that run. Do you know the worrying thing there is that Klossman isn't even slow. Good save. Klossman is even slow, but I felt like I was being held back just because Neymar was alongside me. Damn. Neymar kind of did me there. Yeah, good goal. That's what I've been playing. I've been getting suffocated in this game. It's all right. I've got Elsha, and that's a ball. Ah, oh, that's a nice pass. Maybe I could have done something a little bit better there. Yo, uh, Ronaldo. Go on, Ronnie. Go on, Ronnie. From the corner. Well, perfect game would be 5 0. But we take those. GG. He was a good player as well. Surprised that I won by five, like, or four goals, technically. By four goals. And Ronaldo, was it a hat trick for him? Ah, he's unstoppable. Like, if you got Ronaldo in your team, it's done. But Schweinsteiger, what a bad debut. I give him that. It wasn't bad. Um, I'm not sure. Not sure what I'm going to do with the team with Schweinsteiger. Maybe I'll use him. Maybe I won't. It's a bit of a weird one. 2,200 skill rating. That was a good test at least to see how uh, the team was getting on. But like I mentioned, Schweinsteiger, he's one of these that doesn't feel super agile when you're jockeying and defending. And being really the out-and-out -out CDM in this squad because Mateus has that high-to-high -high role where he's going to push on and support. Yeah, I don't, I don't know really with uh, Schweinsteiger. He's also got high tie work rates himself, but with stay back, I didn't see him pushing out of position. Um, so yeah, I didn't really have any problems there. Good passing on the card. I think he'll have good shooting as well when in position. It, 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 it's just weird. It's just a weird card. I don't know, man. <laughs> Why did it give me Schweinsteiger? I don't know. Anyway, boys, um, this Pereira, I want to see more. I, d I don't know. He just seen, He's all right. all right. He doesn't do anything bad. I just don't really notice him doing anything in game. I think he'd be best played maybe as like a central player in the 4 one 2 one 2 Like right mid, he's just not doing anything. Anyway, thank you very much for watching. I will see you tomorrow. So yeah, I appreciate you guys uh, tuning in. Unfortunately, we got Schweinsteiger. It wasn't the best player pick, but could we say it's a playable one? I think so. So thank you for watching, leave a like, and I'll see you tomorrow. Team out. Peace.